guys, welcome back to my channel, Peppermint Crinkles. This is an op. Anyways, just adjust this. I do apologize for my um, light. Um, yeah, there's something wrong with the, the, the electricity wires. Anyways, so it doesn't work. So, um, I'm going to do this kind of look. Let me zoom in for you so that you can see more closely. And the lips and the rest of my face okay and the eyeshadow that I use I'll be doing a three-part series on this mainly using just one palette and this is from the Beauty UK Posh palette and it's the palette is called Eden and oh my gosh look at that you know how I'm a sucker for neutrals so that's the shade yeah so anyways uh, if you want to see how I did this look, then continue watching. So we're ready to uh, prime the eyelids with Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Then I'm going to take this um, palette, Beauty UK Posh Palette in Eden. Uh, the shadows I'm going to use is this two right here and this um, matte mid-brown tone um, shadow. So first I'm going to apply this one right here using this is Coastal Scents or Crown Brush C200 Deluxe Crease I'm going to apply this on my crease all the way here on the inner corner applying a kind of a mid-tone shadow then I'm going to take my elf eyeshadow brush I'm going to use first the darker shade right here and I'm going to put that on the outer corner of the lid all the way to the center where we're, we're doing backwards by the way so that's why up to the crease and on the tip of the brush, just on the lower lash line, all the way uh, a little to the center, a little away from the center to the inner corner, right here. Somewhat like I'm making a shadow. And then I'm going to take this Coastal Sense or Chrome Brush C218 Blending Fluff. And I'm just going to blend this out, outwards to inwards, all the way blending it out and blending it on the lower lash line. Then going back to your C200 for that mid-tone, just blend it again, right here, all the way with the crease. And then after that, I'm going to take another e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. I'm going to apply now this lighter shade right here and this i'm going to put this on the inner corner all the way to the center overlapping the darkest shade right here just like that all the way up to the crease and inner tear duct and inner corner of your um lower lash line using the tip of the brush all the way right here and going back to your C218 blending fluff, just blend it out all the way like that. So, yeah. Okay. Then I'm going to take this. This is Prestige Skin Loving Minerals and Onyx. This is the Body Shop Slanted Brush. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put this here, right here. And the technique is go back to your Eden. Uh, palette from Beauty UK and mix that with this dark color on the middle. Just mix it a little bit and then smudge it all the way here just to make a little bit of a um, shadow line. That'll do. And then go back to your uh, pencil in Onyx and just comb that through and apply it. 
Okay, this will be very, very quick. That's why it's just a very quick look. Everybody can do this, and I know you've seen this from other beauties already done with different shades. Okay, and then I'm going to take this. This is um, Sush uh, blending brush, and just blend everything. Take this Tony Molly Perfect Eyes Eyeliner in tear beige put that on your waterline next nude matte eyeshadow in lap dance using this elf c brush and this will be for my highlight all the way here and a little bit here to have that kind of highlight and this one right here to clean it up going back to the uh, Sush blending brush blend out that um, highlight shade and that transition color or that crease color lashes using my face shop eyelash curler just give it a little bit of squeeze take my Maybelline rocket volume express um, mascara in black my top coat a Tooth House OM Eyelash Top Coat. Hi guys, so this is the finished look. I hope that you enjoyed the tutorial. So this is the, the finished finish look. I hope it's not too um, bright or whatever, but I hope I just go focus it out. Okay, so here are the products that I use for the rest of my face. Of course, for my toner, my Eskinol Spotless White um, Toner. For my facial moisturizer, I'm using my Olay Total Effect 7-in-1 Anti-Aging Cream. For my lips, I prepped it with my Body Shop Setsuma Shimmer. For my under eye moisturizer, I'm using two ELF Daily Moisture Stick and this um, Egyptian Magic. For my primer, I'm using my Snowy Here Comes the Sun block and I say it's alright, which is an SPF of 45. For my foundation, lighter, um, foundation, I'm using this Nisha Perfect Cover BB Cream and the shade is 21. For my under eye corrector, I'm using this. this is a mixture of NYX Concealer in a Jar in Orange, Rice Powder Company Concealer Stick in Ivory Milani Secret Copper Concealer Cream in Warm Beige. And of course, I um, mixed that with this um, CoverGirl Concealer Neutralizer. For my under eye concealer, I'm using this uh, Maybelline Dream Mousse Concealer in Fair Light. For my lids, I'm using my Rice Powder Company Concealer Stick in yellow and on top of that, I'm using my NYX eyeshadow base in white. Of course, I set my under eye corrector and concealer with e.l.f. eye brightener. And for my cream highlight, I'm using my Body Shop Radiant Highlighter. For my cream blush, I'm using this one. This is Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in Pink Frosting. To set my foundation cream products, I'm using this uh, Milani, the Multitasker Face Powder in Light. Which looks like that. For my brows, I'm using my Maybelline Great Lash Clear Mascara and this e.l.f. Eyebrow Kit in Light. For my under eye brightener, I'm using my Garnier BB Eye Roll On and I set that with this um, e.l.f. Tone Correcting Powder in Warm. Looks like that. Then for my all over bronzer, I'm using this. This is Jean All Free Bronzing Powder in Sahara and for my powder contour I'm using this um, MAC Studio Care Care Blend Pressed uh, Bronzer in Gold Gold Lightly yeah the cover for my uh, blush I'm using this MAC Blush Ombre and Azalea Blossom. Uh, for my powder highlight, I'm using this Bare Minerals. What's this? Ready Luminizer in the Shining Moment. She looks like that. Pretty shade. And then, of course, I set my uh, makeup with my Vanilla and Company Wish Hazel Beauty Tonic. 
and of course for my lips I'm using this this is Revlon moon drops uh, frost lipstick and the shade is I then coffee. for my lip liner I'm using this this is L'Oreal color rich um, lip liner in more chocolate which is kind of a plummy shade I don't know dark with plum um, undertone so what I did is I applied and then I blend it out then for my lip gloss a little bit um, this is collection hot lights lip gloss in star which is really very pretty and that is it guys thank you very much for watching god bless and